three, two, one. Oh, fuck, I missed. <laughs> We're good. Uh, sorry, it's been a while. Uh, five weeks. Sorry, I've got a life. And a beard. Due to him. It's his fault. This is Hugh. You can follow him there. Okay, so this morning, Hugh fucking started watching some Logan Paul. He likes watching Logan Paul. I don't. I personally think he's an asshole. But there's even more of an asshole in this fucking video by the name of Jojo Siwa. Uh... I saw this video this morning, or some of it. I couldn't watch it all because I got enraged and thought, I need to make a video on this shit. It's fucking, it's too much. She just needs to fucking stop, man. Why have you got those glasses on still? <laughs> I don't know. We've got an assortment of glasses for today's video. All of which I promise will be worn. Mm -hmm. What would you say for the people who aren't familiar with Jojo Siwa? So, okay, so what I do on the internet is I create YouTube videos. I film my life every day and upload it. I do Jojo's Juice. But then I also have the side of me that is not just a YouTuber. That is also a, a brand. So, like, I am literally, like, brands license me in a way. And, like, I have merchandising in literally every store. And I'm signed with Nickelodeon. And also I do music. And I'm going on tour. So, like, I'm kind of a mix between a Nickelodeon star, a pop star, star a youtuber it's easier if you just say like i do it all yeah i'm jojo siwa and i yeah. do it all. it's well here's why this is interesting she is not lying so there is oh why is he wearing a bow <laughs> why is he wearing a bow one of the most 360 degree influencers crazy i think yeah. i've ever seen crazy. thank you and you're 15 yes. and a half and, and a half, half. can't and forget about yo, the half. Fucking half no, nobody cares about the half. Uh, yeah, forget about the yeah, half. Also, at the same time, like Mama Siwa. Oh, my mom is incredible. Wow. Tell us. See that? Incredible. <laughs> Fucking incredible. Wow. Uh, we've been like working towards this, me and her, since I was literally two years old. Like two year, two fucking years old. You hear that? Two years old, right? So since she was two, she's been working towards making a YouTube channel. When was the YouTube channel created? February 1st, 2015, so for three years, so for a whole, what's that, 15 and a half, mind you, <laughs> minus, minus, uh, so she was 12 and a half, was, so for, no, she was, yeah, yeah so yeah. for 12 and a half, no, no, 12, 10 and a half years of her life, she was failing, according to her own self. You know, she we did our first TV shows together. So I was on Abby's Ultimate Dance Competition first, and then I was on Dance Moms, Lifetime's number one show. I've never heard of any of these. No, me neither. So they can't be that good. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> All right. Generally pretty nervous as always, but man, I'm well, fanboying. Well, listen, because right thank you, we, mate. We, 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 ooh, fanboying. Oh, ooh, ooh, YouTube friends. <laughs> How can you fangirl over a 50? That's worse. Is that borderline pedophilia? Yeah. Did you, Did you say you do daily? vlogs yes every day yes yes logan that's what daily vlogs means how long has that been bow, going on bow, bow. it's about my i'm actually probably getting close to 600 days shut Ooh. up shut up yeah. that's two years nearly, nearly. Fucking two years man. who the fuck I, starts mm. daily vlogging when she was 13 we, we, oh, ooh, 13 and a half. 13 yeah, and a half. Sorry. Oh, the half, oh you right. can't miss the half. Uh, yeah, we're good about the half. Yeah, shut up. Yeah. Let, let's see her first video. <laughs> Let's have a look at the first video. Hey everyone, it's Jojo, and I'm totally about to vlog because I'm at the airport, and this is where I travel with my blanket. Those are my mom, and then of course Skywalker. Can you see it? Converse, blue lemon shorts, my just a t-shirt, crop top under it, dance top, just in case you never know, and a sweatshirt. Got my cool nails. No one lets their kid dress like that unless they're just fucking. It's like it's like the Honey Boo Boo child, but oh. like actually earns money it's a it's a money version of honey boo boo which i don't understand jojo siwa works harder than you i'm a hundred percent jojo siwa works harder than you do wrong <laughs> no she fucking doesn't her mom does her mom is just no fucking... a, a work crew does not a mom bloody sits at home probably her mom fucking rinses her child for money like you'll see in a sec like, uh. i asked you this what time do you get up in the morning not early. I stay up really late though, so I work really late at night, yeah. whether I'm editing, whether I'm writing, like no matter what I'm doing, like I am a night owl. So like I'll be up till 3 a.m. working on a video. No, no mom <laughs> in the world lets a kid work with 15 and a half. Uh, yeah, forget about the house. Three o'clock in the morning. 
No. No, no. fucking kid in the world would do that. The bedtime's nine o'clock, let's face it. But then, like, I'll wake up at, like, ten-ish. Oh, ten-ish. Oh. Ah, seven hours sleep, you know. If, if your kid doesn't go to school, ends up this fucking retarded. <laughs> you know, let it sleep till ten o'clock, why not? Grinding. Even though, literally, the grind, like, 24-7, it just is non-stop. No kid works 24-7 no, no, with 15 no. and Wait. a half. I can't even get another yeah, half. Shout out. You're, you're working overtime, sonny boy. I see what I want to be doing in five years, and I'm like, okay, what do I need to do now to get there? Hopefully, Hopefully. speaking fucking English. <laughs> have, have, you seen, have you seen the intros to this specimens videos? They're just... It's just fucking pure spew. It's just shit. Like, it doesn't make any sense. I need my fucking... I need eye protection for this one. <laughs> can tell she was homeschooled because she does not have the slightest ounce of English in her vocabulary. I cannot make a decision like for tomorrow. Like tomorrow, I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what's happening next week. But like five years from now, I know what I'm doing. If you're a daily vlogger, I I'm not a daily vlogger, so I don't know this. You you gotta know what you gotta know. You're making a fucking video for the next day, surely. Yeah, you don't just pick up a camera and film a fucking grass grow, do you? You know, oh, yeah. that would be more interesting than her <laughs> shite videos. Well, how many bows do you have? There is over 7,000 in the JoJo bow collection. Oh my god. 7,000. 7,000 bows in her bow collection. I don't know how... 7,000? 7,000 yeah. bows? You want to know something crazier? Guess how many we sold last year? This year, technically, 2018. Guess how many that we sold? I'm, I'm literally afraid to answer. A million. A million? I don't know, Jojo. No I'm, I'm afraid. I'm, I'm literally afraid. I'm flabbergasted. Can, can you just take a guess. You have to guess. All right, all right. I, I, sell, 20, I sell product. I would 22,567. Okay. 100,000. 40 million. Oh, oh. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Jeff. Unbelievable, Jeff. 40 fucking million bows. 40 million bows. 40 million. Who buys her bows? I've done the fucking math, though. She has 8 million right. subscribers. And if all of her subscribers on YouTube bought her bows, every person would have to buy five bows per... That's, that's male or fucking <laughs> female, right? You got fucking five bows, right? Per person. Five fucking bows per person. And that's male or female. I'm pretty sure there's got to be some skinhead kids out there. Um, just, just calling it, oh, they've got short hair, whatever. <laughs> look at look at his face. Look at, his, look at that guy's face. Forty million. He's like he knows. He's like <gasps> lying. Lying. <laughs> Jojo a has a tour, and she is gonna be traveling. What? Just the United States? Just the United States. Yeah. yeah. But also, why did YouTubers go on tour? I don't understand it. Like, you. G what even is a YouTuber tour? Is it like they go to places, they say hi to people, and they leave places? People pay money it's for It's a this. meet and greet, that's what it is. If any any 108 of you wanna watch, watch, wanna meet me, DM me. Please, I'm lonely. I'm merchandising, think of it, like the easiest way for me to explain it is like Spongebob. So like Spongebob is a character who has his face on pretty much everything. Yeah. That's how I am, but the only difference for me is I'm live action. Yeah, She's but Spongebob. She says that she is basically Spongebob. Pop she's live action. A Spongebob episode is like 15, 20 minutes and ah, easy. Multiple a day. Fuck 10 minutes of this bitch. <laughs> I want to commit. <laughs> Fucking animated An show. Animated show. <laughs> animated show, man. <sighs> <sighs> okay, let's check it out. Yo, yo, it's Jojo and Bobo. And you are just seconds away from seeing us animated. Here we go. I used to watch Nickelodeon when I was younger. You used to be good. It you used had to be Zack and Cody, you had Drake and Josh, you had all sorts of shit. I can't remember. Sorry. SpongeBob. SpongeBob was SpongeBob. on there. Uh, and now you got this. Hey everyone, it's JoJo and Bobo. And welcome to the JoJo and Bobo Show Show. It does look, look like you from the side with your with your tash. I thought I had it all 
Like boys ever? Yeah, uh, I don't you, do boys yet. I don't do. I boys hope yet. not. I mean, you're under the legal age, so I hope you don't do anyone. No, I mean, I have a car. What? Just How like do a, you have a car and you can't? <laughs> what'd you get? Because so, like, my yet. first car, my first car was like a '99, like Je Volkswagen Jetta. Did you get it like a, a junker or what? I technically I have a G wagon. Oh, <laughs> ah, okay. A G wagon. She's 15 and has a fucking G-Wagon. Let that sink in. Go on. A G -Wagon. I'll, I'll put my glasses on while, while, let you, while that sinks in. Sinking in yet? No? A G-Wagon. A G-Wagon. Fucking G-Wagon! I have a really wide demographic from dance moms, you know, a True. lot. Like, from YouTube also to, like... I have like my groups of YouTube, like I do like older kid videos, but then I also do like little kid mm. videos. So I have like older kid fans who are anywhere from, I mean, like 13 to 18. But yeah. then like I have those little kid fans who like my music and stuff from like 12 and younger. 12 like younger. your music and stuff. I don't want to go to the cinema with her, ever. Fucking well annoying. Film's about to start, just <laughs> fucking singing. Uh, I'm not for me. Uh, don't know about you, but not for me. I want this Classic. song to mean something. Like, I want this song to be about what I want it to be about. And I was like, what am I passionate about? I'm passionate about anti-bullying. What 12, 12 year old? Or how the fuck? I don't fucking know how old she is. 12, 13, 14, and a half. One of the above. Don't care. No one under the age of 16, at a push maybe, gives a shit about anti bullying. So for someone of this potato headed culture, this is bullying. I just realised. No way in hell when she was 12 she knew what anti bullying was. No. She, no kid in the world. No one cares about anti bullying when they're 12, 13, whatever. They don't they don't really comprehend what it is. Is there a story, is there something in your life personally that motivated you to go after bullying? Yes, very, very much so. Yeah. This, yes. this story. Holy fucking Jesus Christ. Nothing against Jesus, you know? Father up there. But no Let's way. find out what traumatic experiences this poor child has gone through in order to need to make a motivational song about anti-bullying. D-R-E-A-M. Ah. Choreographed dances. Oh my gosh. Jojo, do you, do you write these yourself? I do. She doesn't. Joke's over. <laughs> she doesn't. <laughs> she doesn't. Why, you ask? It's me and then there's other writers and other producers, but I am the sole writer on all my songs, obviously. <laughs> me and then there's other writers. So you didn't write it yourself, okay? You didn't write it yourself. You sat there, you're like, oh, that sounds good. I'll sing it for you. And then apparently she's written it. Bullshit. Shut up. Yeah. But basically while I was there, the first day that I got there, I'm not allowed to say the girl's real name, but the first day I got there, these kids came up to me and go, that's Lucy. We don't like her. Don't talk to her. Talking about herself. No one likes her. No one wants to talk to her because she's fucking loud and fucking annoying. I rest my case. If you like the video, give us a subscribe and shit. I'm out. See you later. That'll do. <laughs>